news. The Pet Expo is wrapping up at the Delta Plex today, but there's still a ton of furry friends to see. Joining us now, Carol from Great Lakes Alaskan Rescue. Good morning, Carol. Thanks for joining us. Uh, who do you have with you? Uh, this is my boy, Yukon. Um, he's uh, almost nine, 115 pounds, <laughs> teddy bear. Um, <laughs> and um, it's Golden Years Alaskan Malamute Rescue that um, I run. And he came in a couple years ago and I fostered him and he stayed. <laughs> what is it about these dogs that's so unique and special? I mean, he's a gorgeous animal that you have there. Thank you. Uh, they're, they're a challenge, but they're a lot of fun. Um, it's almost like having a perpetual two-year-old in the house all the time. Um, they uh, are pretty good with kids. I also have a female at home. Um, and it's, it, this breed is just, uh, they've got such personalities on them that uh, it's, it's hard to resist. But Carol, because they're like a two-year-old, is that why you think some of them needed to be rescued, that owners didn't know what they were getting into when they first got one? <laughs> That is exactly what goes on. Um, they see those cute puppies with the big feet and think they're going to stay that way. And normally they're not quite this large, mm -hmm. um, but they do get into uh, a pet that they really did, didn't uh, know how to handle. And these guys are stubborn and if they can get away with it, they're going to continue to get away with it. They like to get into trouble. Um, but uh, if Look you like a challenge, face. this is the dog. I love it. That face is just beautiful. So where are you guys located <laughs> at? You. And if people maybe have some questions about that breed, I'm, just, I'm certain you're a great resource so people can reach out to you. Absolutely. Absolutely, yes. Um, our facility is located up in Muskegon. Um, my rescue partner, Shirley Thomas, um, has uh, acreage and we've built a kennel up there. We lease uh, some of the land and uh, we can have up to 10 dogs. Um, so we stay pretty full and uh, we are always happy to have have people just come up and play with the dogs or, or come up and just kind of see what the breed is all about, how big they really are, um, how much hair they really have. <laughs> and uh, we're also a resource to anybody that, that's uh, got a Malamute. That they don't have to adopt it from us. We're just, we're kind of a resource out there for anybody that maybe has a question about the breed or has one and uh, um, is having some challenges at home. And Carol, if they do want to try and adopt from you, what sort of a process do they have to go through? We do have um, an adoption application. Uh, they can email us for that. And we do home checks. We do reference checks. Uh, we like to make sure that they understand what they're getting into with this breed. Um, you know, like you see, they're beautiful, but they are a little bit of a challenge. And we like to make sure that people um, applying or are interested in these guys know what they're getting into. Um, because we kind of, once we place them, we really don't want them back. We'd like to have them stay in their homes. Uh, sometimes we, in, we do have some come back. Um, you know, we always take our dogs back. But uh, once they've gone through the um, application process, we've checked the interviews, they come out, they meet the dogs, and if it's all a good fit, they, they take home a, a new friend. All right, all right thank, thank you, you Carol. So uh, Pet Expo runs all this afternoon at the Delta Plex. Okay. You cannot take your own dog there. So if Keep you go, mind. you can yes. leave with a dog or a cat or an animal, but you right. cannot take your own pet to the Pet Expo. Good point. Time now, 838, still ahead. All right, we got more animals. We're going wild.